a shaken campus uniting in grief. The University of Virginia mourning three football players. Two other students were injured after a shooting rocked the school. The shootings occurred on a bus full of students returning from a field trip. Three of the victims did not survive. Gunshots rang out Sunday night, an intense manhunt in and around Charlottesville for the suspect followed. Pardon me. In the middle of a press conference, the news everyone on campus was hoping for. Thank you, Captain. We've just received information the suspect is in custody. Police have identified the suspect as University of Virginia student Christopher Darnell Jones, Jr. The 22-year-old was a freshman on the UVA football team in 2018, but did not play in any games. Police said Jones was arrested about 75 miles outside the Charlottesville campus. The university identified the victims as Devin Chandler, Lavelle Davis Jr., and Deshaun Perry, all current football players. Officials did not identify the two additional students injured in the incident. The UVA football team expressed its heartbreak in a tweet saying, quote, there are no words to describe this tremendous loss to our UVA football family. Their coach calling them incredible young men with huge aspirations and extremely bright futures. A sentiment of sorrow echoed by the University of Virginia's president. My heart is broken for the victims and their families and for all who, those who knew and loved them. The suspect's father told CNN affiliate WTVR he is heartbroken and in disbelief. I don't, I don't know what to say, uh, except I'm sorry uh, on his behalf, uh, and I apologize. Police said the suspect had come to the UVA Police Department's attention before. They said Jones had a prior incident involving a concealed weapon in 2021 outside the city of Charlottesville. UVA's Judicial Council took over the case, and the results are pending, according to police. During a press conference yesterday, UVA's police chief also said that in September, a non-student claimed Jones had made a comment about possessing a gun. But to the knowledge of the police, that person never actually saw the gun in question. The victim's families and the suspect's father shaken, now hoping for answers. What happened? Uh, why did it have to get this far? He could have called me.